Hi Gemini, this is Jackie Tomlin. This is your general reading for the week of October 30th, 2017. Thank you guys for stopping by. Don't forget, if you're seeking a psychic reading, please contact me at JackieTomlin.com or you'll find a link to those readings below this video. Um, it looks like one of the things I'm seeing for Gemini is music. The love of music. Get lost in music. Uh, for some of you, it's a live music venue and a small wish granted. Um, but what I am seeing that jumps out is your temper flaring. Okay, and this is going to be very brief in passing. This is something where someone may say something to set you off and you have your say and then you go on. But that is present for this week. Um, it does, like I said, it looks like more than one small wish granted. The thing about it is it's a slow moving week and Gemini slow never works for you guys. So that's going to be a little frustrating at times. But overall, it does look like victory. So let's take a look. This is for Gemini for the week of October 30th, 2017. Gemini, we start with the Queen of Pentacles, followed by the Two of Swords. Next to that, we have the Two of Wands, the Ace of Pentacles, Major Arcana of Justice, Major Arcana of the World. Seeing that combination in a lot of the signs this week. So let's break this down. I'll pull you three more. What I'm looking at here is that you guys financially sound, um, and that I'll get to that later on in the reading. It does show you have decisions to make, okay? And these decisions are regarding your finances. Beside that, we have the Two of Wands. And this is planning for the future, not so much in a financial aspect, but in every aspect in every area that you're kind of reviewing, rethinking your options, but making plans for your future. This also indicates a small wish or unexpected assistance coming in. Moving forward, we have that Ace of Pentacles. This is a new beginning in your financial sector. And like I said from the beginning of this, Gemini, you're, you're rock solid financially. Then we're looking at that combination of justice in the world. And what we're looking at here is justice being in your favor. With that falling with that Ace of Pentacles, I tend to say this is some kind of loan, something like that coming through, some kind of contract or something to do with your financial situation. Of course, this brings in total happiness. This is the world. The world uh, is your oyster. Things are going well for you. For whatever reason, I have a feeling some of you guys are getting ready to start a business. Okay, moving forward, we have the death card. Also seeing this coming into play a lot. This is the end of a negative cycle, um, a rebirth, a new beginning, followed by a separate new beginning, okay? And that new beginning is now. Don't forget, you also have a new beginning in finances. And what we have here is that Eight of Swords. And the Eight of Swords, if you look at this card, is what I call the card of self-imposed restrictions, that no one is holding you back at this time but you. Big into play this week. Slow moving and for um, your financial sector looking strong. What we're looking at is justice in your favor, followed by the world. And then of course we have the new beginning, uh, the end of the neg negative situation, new beginning. You may actually have more than one this week. And with all those new beginnings coming in and the closure of the old cycle, I can tell you it can create that scattered energy around you guys, but ultimately a good week. Thank you guys for watching. Please take the time to like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you soon. Bye.